I went through a list of examples for how to make a freeze frame using PowerDirector and um, most of the examples I found weren't things I was familiar with. So what I'm going to do now is just give you an example of what I think a freeze frame is and um, if this is what you're looking for then you can go ahead and watch the video else then you can try out other examples you see online. Alright so here is my example with this dog. Hello my name is Riley from Call of Duty Ghost and one thing I like doing is dream. As you can see, I'm currently dreaming about treats, going for walks, and chasing cats. Here is my story. Okay, so that was like a terrible example of how a freeze frame works. But uh, you get the picture, it's like superhero movies, you know. You know, everybody just freezes and the superhero says a few things that um, they are surprised to see. So I'm going to show you guys how to create freeze frames on PowerDirector, like the example I just showed you. Alright, so that's it, let's begin. Um, this is the second time I'm recording this video because I just found a simpler way to do this. Import your video. I'm sure you know how to do that. Let me just cut off the dark part of the video. Alright, so import your video and look for where you want the freeze frame to be. Okay, right here where the dog looks down. I want the freeze frame to be there. It looks weird right now. Okay, this is... I, I think this is okay. Tap the video and then tap split. Now move a few frames forward, maybe two to three frames, tap the video again and tap split. Now you have this tiny video in between the two clips, tap speed and then bring down the speed by a lot, zoom into the video all the way in. All these parts are not needed, just split it at, uh, let's see, I'm sure you can see, okay let me just use the number, so now it's uh, at the point where I split it, it's 12.0. I'm just going to move to 12.1. Tap the video again, split, and delete this part. Because this part has movement. You just need a part where there's no movement. And uh, now, let's say I wanted the freeze frame to last for... Let's say I wanted the freeze frame to last for 7 seconds. So, that will be 12 plus 7 is 19. Just tap the tiny one again, the tiny clip, and then duplicate. Slide this to see the duplicate option. Just keep on duplicating. I think we're stopping at 17, right? Okay, let's just stop at 15. To make it uh, 30 seconds. Now I'm going to play the video for you guys to see. Go back a bit and tap play. So this is a freeze frame. It's like a, a post picture or post video. And then it continues. Alright. This is definitely not the last um, freeze frame video I'm going to make. So if you guys want more examples, just let me know in the comments and I'll create different examples. Maybe I'll just make a video that has um, seven or five freeze frame examples. Just let me know in the comments if you want something like that. But if you understand the video, just give it a thumbs up. And um, subscribe if you haven't. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Alright, bye bye.